Barcelona. But you know he's not happy with that technical score. No. Number eight, representing Russia, Sergei Voronov. This would be some accomplishment for a veteran from Russia. 27-year-old Sergei Voronov, who has never made it in the nine years on the circuit to the Grand Prix Final. He's got a chance. He won the silver medal a few weeks ago at Grand Prix Russia, the third time he's medaled on the Grand Prix circuit. He took everyone by surprise, but can he keep that going here at this competition? So far, so good. Great start. This is amazing. I have to say, I'm just loving this music after hearing Phantom on repeat for the last nine <laughs> programs. But it wouldn't mean nothing. He has a second quad planned. To take us over the road. Turned it into a triple. This seems to be a pattern for Sergey. At his last Grand Prix, he nailed the first quad, and then his second was a triple, and I couldn't tell if it was intentional or not. So it could be strategy. change of direction of <laughs> these musical cuts here's a skater who's won two russian national championships but he's always been in the shadow of others like plashenko and now maybe maxim kovtun but he had the skate of his life at the european championships this past season won the silver medal and even though he's one of the oldest skaters out there he said he feels young and he has no intention of stopping anytime soon Terry, but I have to say, he's getting his name in the mix. He's on his game so far this season. Yeah. It's still definitely the dark horse. That entrance into the triple axle, he takes it with such speed. Everyone keeps talking about his age, but I have to say he's one of the skaters, the older skaters, that still seems so spry and energetic to me, especially when it comes to the jumps. A lot of the skaters start to lose their quad legs as they age. And it's weird talking about this because 27 is not old. <laughs> but it's true. You just don't have that spring to your jumps, and he still has that. He's got the athletic spring. It doesn't seem 27 years old, no? That's what I'm saying. <laughs> lives in Moscow, trains in Moscow, but he says it takes him about two hours to get to the rink. It's quite a bit of traffic in that city. His day's off, he goes to the countryside to get away.
sticking it out it has its benefits. And glad he's still on the scene. On the verge, perhaps, of quite an accomplishment. We'll see. Making it to the Grand Prix Final for the very first time in his career after Sergei almost a decade Verona, out here on the circuit. Sergei Verona from Russia. In fourth place after this short program. A little more than seven. Back after a very good performance from Sergei Voronov of Russia. This was the highlight of his program, the quad toe, triple toe. So much power, so much attack. That's what I really love about his jumping. Whether it's perfect technique, whether it's a bit wild, he goes for it, throws himself into the air, and somehow he's, <laughs> he's landing Finds his them. way. And you know what? I enjoy watching him skate. Is he going to be a contender for a world medal? I don't know. Is he going to be a contender in 2018? Probably not. But right now, this is fun. 236.65 and into first place overall. Three skaters left, but 